guys, it's Chris here. Hope everyone's doing well. So today, firstly, if we're going to be talking about Metallica, you've got to wear a leather jacket, haven't you? It's just it's just law. It's rock and roll law, I think. So I did. Um, so what we're doing is we're, we're trying to sort of chase Metallica's guitar tones today using Kirk Hammett's signature modules, signature preamps. Okay, so if you don't know what these preamps are, back in early 2000s, uh, Bruce Ignace had come up with this concept where you can interchange modules, preamp modules. Um, so you'd have an amp or um, a rack and you can put in different sounds and use the power amp of the amp or get a dedicated power amp itself. Um, and then he licensed that to Randall and then Randall worked with Kirk Hammett to come up with a signature set. So Kirk actually has a, a signature head with them that I think is the KH100, I think it's called. Now that's basically the same as I understand it as my RM100, so they're basically the same thing. But he also came up with three modules. He came up with um, the KH1, which is a clean module, the KH2, which is designed off Metallica's early sort of sounds, and then the KH3, which is more of a kind of lead-based um, more modern Metallica sort of sound. So for all the rhythm guitars, I use the KH2, and for all the leads, I use the KH3. And I came up with a slightly inspired Metallica track, as you can quite probably imagine where the, the riff first came from. <coughs> Master <Massive> purpose. <coughs> um, <laughs> and so uh, I just wanted to, to kind of pay homage to one of my favorite bands in the world. I absolutely love Metallica, I love the power. I'd forgotten just how technical and involved sort of playing Metallica riffs are. <laughs> Sounds silly, but I don't really play them anymore, especially the fast, heavy stuff. Um, so coming up with this, it took me a, it took me a bit of time, to be honest, to kind of perfect it. And I'm sure it's not not perfection, as in the eyes of James Hetfield, in terms of the, you know, the rhythm and everything. But, you know, let me know what you think, guys. If that has been any kind of help or... Um, any interest to you at all I'd really appreciate if you could like and subscribe helps with the whole YouTube machine and it kind of gets the the channel kind of noticed a little bit more which is really nice because I spend quite a bit of time putting these demos together and making the videos and it's nice just kind of get you know get the views on them really so guys I shall see you in the next one you take good care of yourselves and keep on rocking in the free world take care